The start of high school winter sports has been delayed until at least February 21st. Today, the MHSAA says they'll be ready as soon as that ban is lifted. 13 on your side, sports director Jamal Spencer joins us now with more, and they are chomping at the bit, Jamal. Most definitely. MHSAA Executive, Mark, Executive Director Mark Ewell met with the media this morning to clarify the organization's positions. They want to play winter sports as soon as possible, and they feel like they're headed in that direction. One week ago, Robert Gordon resigned as the director of the Michigan Department of Health and Human Services. Since then, the MHSAA has been determined to provide the MDHHS with as much data as possible to show that the pilot testing program that fall sport athletes and coaches used has worked. The MHSAA says they never considered taking legal action against the state and they will try to resume high school sports instead since they've decided to let the numbers do the talking. Given the fact this week that there is now uh, better communication that we feel like um, for the first time in a long time that they're looking at the data and they understand the data and they can see how the data can affect um, future decisions. Um, that's really where we're putting our entire focus right now. Yule says the MHSAA feels like all winter sports could return sooner than the February 21st deadline, but parents and athletes and coaches must remain patient. Ultimately, that decision still rests with the Department of Health and Human Services and Governor Whitmer.